The Wallace Collection, with whom the French Embassy and French Tech London have partnered to showcase the importance of women in tech. Today, students from London's French lycées are trying out new interactive art app, Smartify. Smartify is a social enterprise uh, with a mission to make art more accessible and to support museums. And essentially it is a virtual art guide that allows people to instantly hold up their smartphone, scan an artwork and get all the information about that artwork straight to their phone. It's helpful. Everyone has a smartphone, so it's accessible to everyone. So it's a good idea. But is the tech startup industry really more difficult for women? There are definitely challenges. It's still harder to raise investment. All the studies are showing that um, diverse teams, you know, they massively outperform uh, teams that are kind of uh, less diverse. But there are certain sort of things in the startup world that you have to do that are still dominated by a male kind of profession. To address this issue, a conference was organised at the Wallace Collection to inspire the next generation of female tech entrepreneurs. The objective of the event is to give the audience um, a bit more information about how to attract more girls and women into tech. Taking part was French artist and engineer Mylène Guermont, creator of the impressive FAR installation in Place de la Concorde, Paris. Also there was Smartify's Anna Lowe, Camille Rougier, co-founder of Plural AI, Claire Calmejan, a director at Lloyd's, and Sophie Adelman, co-founder of White Hat. Actually, many women have confidence issues or imposter syndrome issues around you know, applying for incredible opportunities. What we do is actually give them the skills, give them the tools, give them the confidence to be successful. And I think the great thing about an apprenticeship is because you're gaining qualification whilst you're working, you actually can demonstrate how amazing you are as an employee in the workplace. Marina, aged 20, is just one of those apprentices. The fact that we're living and born into a tech age, I feel like it will become more diverse because it's more natural to us. Everyone, like all young people, are on social media 24-7. So I feel like that aspect of it will be more reassuring for them because it's something they love. Attending the Wallace Collection was French Economy Minister Bruno Le Maire. More than anything else, we must emphasise training for young women. His visit followed that of Marlene Schiappa, Gender Equality Minister, and as part of a drive to show that the French startup scene for women and for men is thriving. The French tech scene, particularly in creative tech, which is what we do, is really big. It seems to be booming.